In 2022, nearly 49,000 people lost their lives to suicide in the United States. Several organizations are spreading awareness about it during Suicide Awareness Month. One of those is the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. They recently hosted their annual walk at the Capitol. Healthcare providers also want to remind people that clinics can help them find resources and get help. Dr. Andrew Obrich says that's why they use screening questionnaires during each visit. He says every day he meets a patient who matches the criteria for a mental health problem. If you're at all in doubt, reach out. And a great resource for that is by dialing 988. That's the suicide and crisis line. And that line isn't just for the person who is in a bad place in their life. It's for the friend or family member who has concern. He says your doctor can refer you to local therapists and help you choose your next best steps. He also says for those in rural areas, telehealth therapy has come a long way.